ask Tom on Home Show. Walton from Richmond, Texas has a question about wood refreshment. Yeah, Tom, he's got this paneling throughout his uh, his home, mostly in the living room. And he's a little vexed by it. He, he writes, I'm the second owner and I've lived here for 20 years. To my knowledge, the paneling has never been oiled, only dusted. He says, should I oil or preserve the paneling or leave it as is? And if I oil it, Tom, which one would you recommend he use? I don't want him to put a straight oil on there. It'll make a sticky, ooky mess. You don't want that. But there's something my mother taught me and made me do in the house one year. And when I was maybe eight years old, and I never got along with her after that. But she made me wash all the paneling and all the beams with a thing called Murphy's Oil Soap. It works great. That's how I learned about this. And I've done it many times in the past since then, uh, always remembering that fateful day. But as far as that goes, follow the directions. Just wash it down. It has an oil in there. It'll look fantastic. It'll clean the wood nice. It won't hurt the finish. And that's what you have to do. And if you have children and want to traumatize them, you certainly can make them do it. <laughs> I just had to put that little side you got off. it's pretty boring you got off. The, the answer yeah. is use a murphy's oil soap and that would be it so i wanted to have a little story with it you got off easy <laughs> yeah i did i'm fine because my mother <laughs> you know what my mother yes did. sorry about Made traumatized. You make, what we, i was gonna say biscuits and gravy <laughs> no no this one's even better you know that yeah. summer between your junior and senior year in high school it's your last free year of your life um yeah. When you have no responsibilities, you know, I, uh, um, I didn't have one of those, but okay. Yeah, well, she decided that was, did. that was the year we'd open our family restaurant 24 hours a day. And who could she have <laughs> run it overnight when all the drunks come in? Well, I so, knew it was going to be the restaurant. Yeah. It Mama's was, it was, cafe. What yeah, was it called? Gra Grandma's kitchen. Still there to this day. Grandma's in, in, kitchen. Okay. In, in Whitefield, New Hampshire, there to this day under different ownership, but it's, uh, Whatever, but I'll never forget those many nights learning a lesson. And following all the COVID protocol. Yes. And learn, yeah. Learn, <laughs> learning a lesson that has informed me the rest of my life. And you know what that lesson is, Tom? You hate cheesecake. Never argue with a drunk. <laughs> all right. No, no, yeah, no, don't. <laughs> it's true. But and you don't I have to argue. Say, with, don't argue with, you can't argue with stupid, but drunk but, Well, there it too. is. And you don't have to argue if you need help because all you got to do is visit here. Go visit homeshoreo.com and click on that blue button. It'll take you to this page. That's where you send us a video or your question in writing, and we'll answer it just like this. Post a new one every day at homeshoreo.com, our Facebook page, and our YouTube channel.